I'm Pamela. This is my kitchen where I put value-added produce to the test. And today, Ike, can you say hello? Hello. And I are going to make breakfast, and we have Concord's new blueberry muffin mix. Uh, this retails for $2.89, and all you have to do is add a cup of fresh blueberries, a uh, half a cup of milk, and an egg. And I'll go ahead and wash the blueberries well. Ike wrestles with the box. Okay, thanks. And, and, I'll, and I'll dump it. Dump it. I tell you what, I... There's the oven. It's ready now. I'm a pretty good cook, but I am probably one of the world's worst bakers. So I've never actually made blueberry muffins from scratch. So now we stir it up well for... It says for three to four minutes or until all dry ingredients are wet. Now I've got it all ready here and Ike's going to dump in the blueberries and you gently fold them in. So you fill the cups halfway full. And I'm just guessing. Now this box of mix is supposed to make 12 but as you see my pan only makes 6. So I'm going to go ahead and throw these in the oven 13 to 15 minutes or until the toothpick thing comes out clean. <laughs> Alrighty, we're ready to take them out of the oven here. When we shake the... So these are fresh out of the oven and they look really cute. And I like how the uh, blueberries are on the top. I thought they would maybe sink to the bottom. Um, well, thank you, Ike. And, but we, we're supposed to wait until they're completely cool before eating. And I don't think that's going to happen. But we're going to let them cool down just a little bit. It's all the way cooked through the middle. There's lots of blueberries. And yum. That's pretty good. It's very the batter is very sweet, but the blueberries aren't sweet at all. Well, sweet in a blueberry kind of way. So it kind of is a nice balance. I'm gonna give that an eight out of ten on the squeezy fruit scale. Thanks for watching Pamela's Kitchen, where I put value added produce to the test. If you know something I should try, send me an email at PamelaR at ProduceRetailer.com. Bye!